Hello everyone, I'm Francisco Nunez, the principal conductor of American Young Voices here in the US, and I'm so excited to be with all of you from around the world. You know, we're connecting with people from four continents for this special project. And I wanna say a special shout out to our friends in the UK, led by the incredible conductor, David Lawrence. And thank you, David, for leading us in the first part of the series of a two-part workshop on the power in me. You know, we're all alone in our homes these days, but the truth is it gives us an opportunity to look and see how can we connect virtually with all of our friends. This gives us an opportunity to be creative and imaginative and seeing how is it that music can bring us together. And here we are right now coming together because it's this great song. And with this music, it allows us to feel good. And one thing that happens to me when I feel good is I start to smile. And that smile brings joy to other people's faces, maybe your family and your friends who are near to you right now. So continue to smile and find the power in you to sing along with us in this fabulous workshop. So here we go. So we're getting ready for the big day of June 2nd when we all come together and sing this fabulous song written by a Jersey girl. No, not New Jersey here in the US, but Jersey in the UK. And I'm so excited to be able to sing The Power in Me. Now, I know many of you already have the materials. You've been looking through them and you've learned the first part at the last workshop. But right now, even though you know the whole song, and you feel really good about it, let's take this opportunity to sing together and see what else you can learn. Maybe there's a different perspective that I'll be able to give to you. What I wanna do is start off with a warm up because when you prepare your voice, you're able to sing in a beautiful, beautiful way. There are three parts of the warm up that I'm gonna do. One is physically getting your body ready. Second is getting your breath ready. And third, phonating or getting the sound ready to sing this pop song. Let's begin with the warm up of our bodies. So we just have to warm our bodies up by just shaking them like this. Everybody shake your body any way you want. Get those wiggles out and be relaxed. That's number one. Clamp your hands together, push forward, forward, and then up and down. So that one more time. Hands together, push forward, up and down. Now, make sure your fingers are where your pants seams may be and you're standing very straight. Your legs are shoulder width apart, your hands are to the side and your chest is up. Put an invisible string to this part of your chest and put it all the way up to the ceiling, connect it there. Take another string, connect it to the back, put it all the way up to this part of the ceiling and let your body just feel comfortable in that position. Very tall, very artistic. Now, you're gonna take your shoulders all the way up and all the way down. Shoulders up, relax the neck and down. Your neck goes down and then sideways, back down to the other side. Looking, and go back down, look to the side, any side you wish, back down, look to the other side and forward. And now let's just rub our hands so we can make some funny sounds as we're talking around, go, oh, relax your chin and your mouth, oh, and not too hard, but there you go. Massage yourself, move around. Good, now you're really relaxed. Next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna pat your body down. We're gonna count to eight as we pat our right arm, our left arm, our right leg, and our left leg. I should be your mirror. Here we go, counting to eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 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 eight. Now we're gonna count down to seven, then six, and five, and four, and three, and two, and one. You ready? Let's start with eight all the way down. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 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 One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 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 One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. 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 One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, 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 one. And release. Ooh, that was excellent. You did a great job. Next, we're going to do our breath control. We're going to breathe in through our nose for two counts and breathe out through our mouth for two counts. You're going to count one, two, one, two. With a little pause in between. A little song like this. Will you try that with me, please? 
Ready? In. Out. Again. Kind of like you were getting ready to eat a hot cup of soup. You're gonna breathe in and blow it out. Breathing in, it all out. Good job. The last thing we're gonna to do today is we're gonna create sound. It's called phonating. When we start to use our voice, it actually starts from talking and it starts from just making sounds. And there are three parts of our voices we're gonna use. The high voice, the middle voice, and the low voice. Some of you have very, very high voices and some of you have very, very low voices. Use them all. Make sure the entire range comes out. So the first one's, this is high, this is middle, this is low. Say that, go. This is high, this is middle, this is low. Eh ha. Try that. Eh ha. Donkeys have the best sound. Eh ha, eh ha, eh ha. Try it again, ready? Eh ha, eh ha, eh ha. Very good. Noises are great, especially animal noises. If all kinds that you can come up with will make sure that you'll be able to see the upper voice and the lower voice. When we sing in the music today, um, The Power in Me, we're going to want to use a voice that's right in the middle. A lot of upper voice with a little bit of the lower voice in the middle mixed. And that is going to give us a really great sound in order to sing this fabulous piece of music. Now we're going to sing an A and we're going to come down on 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 in D major. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, count those numbers, go. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, going up. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, going up. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, one more. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Lovely, you sound fantastic. We've made some sounds, we took our breaths, and we made our bodies warm up. I think we're getting ready to actually learn to sing the bridge of the power in me. Here we go. Let me get myself over to the piano. So what I'm going to work on with you is the bridge. What is the bridge exactly? Well, last time you learned about the three verses and the three times that the chorus comes in. The chorus is always the same, but the verses have changed in the words. This is the part that connects those pieces with the tail end of the piece. We call it the bridge because it's like a bridge connecting one to another. It uses some of the material that was already in the beginning part of it and just repeats it to give it a driving force so we can get ready to the very end. And usually when you go back into the chorus at the end, you have some kind of special thing that happens and here it's gonna be the clapping. Then after that, we're gonna go into a key change and build up the excitement and the energy and bring it home. We're gonna start right where the guitar solo takes us off on the E minor chord, getting us ready for the bridge. And in the bridge, you're gonna say three things. We got the power, you got the power, I got the power, the power in me. Let's say that, ready? We got the power, you got the power, I got the power, the power in me. That phrase happens four times. The first time sounds like this and it goes down. We got the power. Will you sing that with me? We got the power. Good. Second time is you and it goes up. You got the power. Can you try that? You got the power. Very good. The last time is a long one. It gives a nice bluesy sound. I got the power, the power in me. Short at the end. Try that. Three, four. I got the power, the power in me. Let's do all three of those lines. First it's we, then you, then I. Two, three, four. four. We got the power, you got the power. I got the power, the power in me. Again, we got the power, you got the power. I got the power, the power in me. That's fantastic. Let's do it with some rhythm. Here we go. On. We got the power. You got the power. I got the power, the power in me. We got the power. You got the power. I got the power, the power in me. Two more times. 
we got the power. You got the power. I got the power. The power in me. We got the power. You got the power. I got the power. The power in me. And you know that part already. It's so much energy. Now, when you sing those four, each one gets stronger and more energized because you're telling, you got the power, we got the power, I got the power in me. Now, this part is the response to the call. I got the power in me. And you say, got the power, got the power, I got the power in me. And that sound goes up. And it sounds like this. Got the power, got the power, I got the power in me. Got the power, got the power, I got the power in me. It happens just two times. Would you sing that with me? I'll sing it the first time and then you echo me. Got the power, ready and go. Next one. Got the power, you try that? Last time, I got the power in me. Two, three. And make sure your breath is really held right there when you do it so you don't push. Now try that with me. You come in on beat four. One, two, three. Got the power, got the power. I got the power in me. Got the power, got the power. I got the power in me. Very, very good. That's a lot of fun. Great job, guys. We're going to put that all together at the end of this video. But for now, let's move on to the next section. There are going to be seven measures, seven bars that come in where you're going to have so much energy and you're going to be applauding. Now, I'm told that Andy is going to come help us with some movement. And I can't wait to see what that's going to be. But in the meantime, I know we're going to clap. You're going to clap for seven measures and you're going to stop and then you're going to sing I got the power in me, in me. And that's the big moment that we have the key change and the whole place goes bonkers because they love it. The audience is going to start applauding at this point. I am sure whoever's listening at home is going to just start rocking out with us. Let's try that clapping. One, two, three, four. One. Three. Four, five, six, seven. I got the power in me, in me. I the energy is fantastic. Can you imagine thousands of children across the globe singing this song along with us? Now, I did promise you that we're going to sing the entire thing, so in two parts, but I need some help. So I'm going to call my friend David to come on over and maybe he'll help me conduct the other part. Hey, David. David, are you there? It's me, Francisco, in the US. Hello, how are you, David? Hey, Francisco, how are you? I'm fine, how are you? I'm doing great. Um, may I ask, what are you doing just now? Uh, well, you may well ask. Um, I'm attempting to lay a laminate floor and I'm being incredibly unsuccessful, I can tell you. <laughs> I'm so happy I caught you at the perfect time. So I was talking to all young people around the world and we're getting our video ready for Power and Me, the big event happening right. on June 2nd. And I'm at the end of the video and I was hoping that you might join me in conducting through the entire piece. Do you think you can help me with that? Uh, that's a fantastic idea. Um, I don't have a baton, but I've got this. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't have a baton either. You get your baton and I'll get something that looks like a baton and let's get this thing done. Would you mind? I love it. Great. You, um, great. Great. Give me two seconds and I'll get out of this, uh, whatever this is. <laughs> and good luck with that floor. Thank you. I will need it. <laughs> Hello, everyone. So here we are again and I have my friend David over in the UK and we're going to conduct through the power in me, which we're all going to do together worldwide on June 2nd. David, are you ready? I am as ready as I can ever be. Uh, hey, uh, but when we get to that two-part bit, how about you take the bit that goes, got the power? 
I will do exactly that. I will conduct the part that says got the power and you can just conduct straight through. So whoever's yep. following us, you'll know exactly what's going on. By the way, at home, if you can't decide which part to sing, why don't you sing either part that you wish to sing and maybe someone in your home that's singing with you can sing the other part. Here we go, right. guys. Are you ready, David? Let's do this. I'm ready to go. Here we go. When the race is nearly done And I feel I can't go on I know I can do something about it My heart will start to race My body finds the motion And I will feel empowered from within I've got the power in me You've got the power in you I've got the power, power, power Got the power in me Nobody's gonna hold me back Nobody's gonna silence my words Nobody's gonna close my mind I've got the power in me When someone's needing help And the world just walks on by terrific i had such a great time i hope you guys had a great time david i hope you had a great time too thank you so much for joining me good luck with that floor and i'll see you very soon on june 2nd great job everybody great job francisco see you on the 2nd of june June 2nd is the big day. I can't wait to work with you. We're going to meet Gigi. We're going to meet Andy. We're going to see David again. And I'm going to be there with hundreds, if not thousands and thousands of children from around the world. Mark your calendars and we'll see you for the power in me on June 2nd.
Thank you. Bye.